So it's the world champions playing the premiers in the perfect start for a football-hungry Melbourne. And the crowd blocked out to see it. Also tonight, highlights of other matches and Scott Palmer's punchlines. And the MCG clash between Melbourne and Fitzroy. The Demons reeling from a record grand final loss, but having won the night premiership. The Lions finished 12th last year, but under new coach Rod Austin, hope to improve. And a good evening to you. And at this time, every Saturday night, Saturday night the football replay from 6 until 7.30. So we, can hope, we hope you can stay with us for the next hour and a half for your dose of football if you've been missing out over the summer months. Well, naturally, we start with the game at VFL Park between the Premiers and the World Champions. A crowd of 50,000 turned up there, and what a spectacle they got. Let's, uh, let's start off with the highlights of the first three quarters before we go to the thrilling last term. Set it up, looking for Dunstall. Dunstall is against Gaper. Well done by Gaper to fist it away. The Hawks are there through Loveridge. He's got it, Richard Loveridge. He picks it up and he's hooked it back at the goals. Loose man there, Gowers, and it's a goal. No, it spilled over the line, actually. But a good effort by Taylor, who's moving well. Oh, well done. Stars of Mr. Kerrison for a goal. It's at half four with Robertson. Now Morwood, oh, smothered beautifully by McGinnis. Now Gavin Brown, the Morwood is having a magnificent quarter. He sets it up for Taylor. Oh, Taylor, a brilliant mark. There should be a goal coming up for the Magpies, and it is. Now here's Bacanara, had a good first quarter. A quick kick is to Abbott, to Platten. Platten has set it up for Dunstall. Dunstall at the back. Oh, yes, great. What a great mark, Bernie. Yes, tremendous play, Jason Dunstall. And Michael Gaither and a strong mark. 30 metres out for his second goal. And I think he has put it through. He played one outstanding game in the Panasonic Cup games. To Kerrison. Kerrison's gone long. New in front. Couldn't take the mark. Here's the chance as Alexander gets it across to Barwick. Barwick on towards the forward pocket. Here's Doug Barwick on the left foot. Hooks it back brilliantly. And he might have put this through. Taylor with a big charge, what a mark! Ryan Taylor right in front, 40 metres out, gets his second. Over the back was Krasiska, always oh, tackled very, very strongly. Here's a chance for Krasiska again as he shuffles it out for Gavin Brown. Brown wide to Robertson, they're playing loosely the Hawks. Robertson, off he'll go. He should kick for Taylor. He handballs to Alexander. 50 metres out the youngster. He straightens up, fires a goal. It could be another one. Yes. He bangs it back to the goal square. Climb at the back by Abbott. No mark. Platten. Back to Whitman. He snaps and goals. Over the back of the pack, a chance for the Magpies. Little Alexander's there. Can he pick it up? He might go for the hand pass. He swings around. He's caught. He's got play on, said the umpire. There's a kick by Taylor. And it's a goal. 48 metres, and will it get there? It's close. Right on the line, it's tapped back into play. Dunstall. Goal. Barwick has kicked a goal. This from 55 metres. Almost kicks the air out of the ball. It makes the distance. And it's a goal. Beautiful now, long kick for goal there from and Duck Barwick. Gary Ayres reckons that hit the post and I don't disagree with him. 16 kicks, 6 marks and 4 handballs. What a great performance. Now, Morrissey will mark this. Uncontested. The banana kick at goal and I think he's put it through. <laughs> oh, miraculous. Well, Hawthorne started with the first couple of goals of the match and in the first 10 minutes the Magpies weren't in it. But the Pies came back to lead by 7 points at quarter time, 20 points at half time and 15 points at three.